complete treatment, first of all, starts with looking at the physical body, looking at people's body. And this is why we need doctors. It's why we need nurses and nurse practitioners and, and medical professionals who can look at the body that, that encompasses, that, that, that carries all of the rest of us uh, and, and help make sure that it is right. Another big part of us that is intertwined with our body is, is our mind, the way we think, our psyche. There's so many different words for it, but essentially how we think and how we process information, uh, that is, is a part of us that can be damaged. And you cannot separate the, the mind and, and the body. So once you take care of the body, you begin to, to heal the mind as well. But there is something else that all of us have. It is the thing that makes us move, the thing that animates us, uh, the thing that is innately eternal. And that we call that spirit. Sometimes we call it soul. But that part of us must also be healthy. And it longs for connection, connection to other people, connection to, to ourselves, connection to all of life. And what addiction does is it disconnects. And so true treatment of this disease of addiction requires that, that we bring healing to the body, that, that we bring healing to the mind and that we create openness and connectedness in the spirit. Not only is it good to treat them all together, but it is imperative because though they are separate parts of us, they are completely interconnected.